Hi guys, it's Kathy here. We've been out in the garden all day and we've been mowing and doing a lot of gardening and I thought I need something quick and easy for dinner and I had some cabbage from the garden so I decided to put together a recipe that was sort of based on what my mum used to make when I was a kid. I've called it Aussie style chow min and it's really good even if you don't like cabbage it's a great way to use up cabbage kids will love it and you can't taste the cabbage at all I've put together the video and um, I'll be making some more videos upcoming too with produce from our garden as it comes through because I'm always thinking of what can we make with all this produce that we've got and yeah I hope you enjoy the video and uh, I'll see you next time okay some oil into your frying pan then dice up one onion and shred a quarter of a cabbage just stir that through the oil to make sure that it all gets coated nicely and have your fry pan fairly hot but just make sure that you don't burn the cabbage next I add two spring onions and I slice those up and mix those through as well then I add in some beef mince, but you could add in chicken or whatever mince that you would like. And I just break that up with the spatula and get that all nice and brown in the fry pan and just combine everything. Then I grate one carrot and stir that through the mixture as well, just turning everything. Then add salt and a crack of pepper and also some garlic or any other spices that uh, you might like. Next I add in a sachet of chicken noodle flavoured soup and that is the secret ingredient that hides the cabbage flavour. Next I add in about one to two tablespoons of tamari. You can use soy sauce or any uh, cooking sauce that you might prefer. Then I've got some brown rice vermicelli and I put in half a packet and I just break that up and stir it through. It just adds a few more noodles to it and makes it go a bit further. Then the next thing that I do is add in about a cup of water and just make sure that everything's mixed well. I just spread it out across the pan and then I add in some peas and some snow peas. But you could add in any greens that you like, any extra herbs, whatever. You can just make this recipe your own. And there we are. There's my bowl of food and it was delicious. See you next time, guys.